I was intrigued by the prospect of how we get that person in the mid 50s, the chain of events that take him to that. What I found fascinating was that in the books you do have a very specific and very kind of a dark character really. The great thing about starting with books is that it all exists in your imagination. So you, there's a freedom there, you know, rather than replicating what another actor has done. That's obviously with, with a huge amount of respect. So when we first began to discuss it, we all agreed that to do a carbon copy would be like dissatisfying both for me and for everyone else, but also for an audience as well. Then I began to see the, the benefit of having never seen them. What I would like to achieve is, is, is to please the audience that already exists and know those stories, but also for me to create something new and to create a new audience who, like myself, perhaps did not know the original series. So all of those things were on my mind and we kept having dialogue and discussions about them. And so I did have a sense of where he ends up. And I think the most important thing is that, like in the books, he's got, it seems to me, his relationship with women is a very interesting one. And I was curious about where that begins. If you dig away in the books, it sort of, it tells you really his mum died when he was 12 years old of cancer. The mum and dad had already split up. His dad had moved on with somebody else. And so then, as he's just about to reach puberty, he has to go and live with his, his dad, who he doesn't have a great relationship with, and this woman, who he, again, doesn't have a great relationship with, which, He's a sensitive guy anyway, it turns him in on himself. But I think one of the most important things is that this kid has seen his own mum die and couldn't do anything to save her, which I think drives him throughout the rest of his whole life, really. So his personal relationships with women are kind of interesting as a result of that. And also this idea of the femme fatale, him being like easy prey. I was kind of interested in all those things, and I know we all were as a team, so it's kind of fertile ground as well, I think, to be able to tell stories in.